Bridge of the Gods. On that side over there is Washington. This is Oregon, Washington. I'm gonna go up here and cross. made it to Washington. This bridge is extremely narrow. Officially in Washington. Officially in Washington. Last stretch of the PCT. My home state. Oh, feels good. So it's August 19th. I am officially in Washington State as of today. It uh, feels, feels really good to be here in Washington and to know that I've gone through so much, so much to get to where I am right here, right now. I am flooded with many different types of emotions right now. Um, knowing that home is so close and that this is the last stretch of the PCT until Canada and I've had a lot of things going on the past few days um, <coughs> uh, back home. Uh, my dog my dog passed away <laughs> um, a couple of days ago on uh, August 17th. Uh, so that's something that has been pretty rough for on me for the past couple of days. And I had planned on bringing my dog with me on trail for parts of Washington <clears throat> and yeah but I feel I feel her with me I can see her in my mind's eye running up and down the trail um, I can feel her her presence with me on trail and I can see her um, I can feel her yeah, it's, she was the best dog <laughs> I could ever have asked for. So many memories with that dog up in the mountains. And yeah, I've ha I had her for over 10 years. You wanna go on a hike?
what I can. the next stretch of Washington, um, I'll have a lot of time to heal, heal for what's happened uh, in the past couple days with the passing of my dog, because time, time heals pain and nature heals all. patience and just gotta understand my dog lived a great life. Feels good to be in Washington. It really, really does. Today has been a roller coaster ride of emotions, just as the past couple days have. But I've experienced the highest of highs and the lowest of lows in the past couple days, and just had time to think and process today here on trail, so, yeah, <laughs> I'm almost, almost at camp, I got like 0.2 miles, and I'm really hot, it's been very muggy and humid today, um, but not much further.